Hello friends! In this video, you will learn about the biggest mega project of the Wazirabad Canal in Kabul. Stay tuned until the end of this video. As you can see, the construction of the central canal of Wazirabad has not been finalized since 2013 due to the lack of capacity for planning and design, despite financial funding from the World Bank. The design process of the central branch of the Wazirabad Canal from 2013 to 2017 was reviewed in two stages by the Kabul Municipality and the Design Capital Zone Department, and a case of co-design that was carried out by the Kabul Municipality was reviewed by the German Goff Engineering Company. However, due to the problems in the construction work, its design has not been implemented. And finally, the design work of this project was done in exchange for 200,000 US dollars from the budget of Kabul Municipality due to the lack of internal technical facilities and to avoid wasting time without going through the tender process from a single source to the company. Lebanon has been deposited, which is currently under construction. Kabul Municipality and the Capital Zone Administration, the construction work of Wazirabad Central Canal was contracted by the Kabul Municipality to an Azerbaijani company in 2017 because it was financed by the World Bank in the framework of the projects proposed by the Kabul Municipality and its sub-branches were managed by the administration. The capital zone was built from the budget of the Afghan government in two years. Although the former mayor of Kabul says that he entrusted the design contract of the Wazir Abad Central Canal project to the Lebanese Khatib Company due to the lack of internal capacities without a tender from a single source, but the officials of the Capital Zone Development Department say that in the design department, the technical capacities with they have a master's certificate and have completed the design of the sub-channels of the Wazirabad project with the available capacities of this office within three months. According to the claim of the Capital Zone Development Department, even though the route of the sub-channels of Wazirabad was not clear, however, within three months, the route of these canals was traced and the design work was finalized by the Capital Zone Administration. And by the beginning of 2018, the construction of the secondary canals was also finalized by this administration. While the work path of Kabul Municipality and the main canal project of Wazirabad was clear with the existence of absorption channel, but since 2013, the survey and design of the central branch was started by the municipality, and until now, 11 years have passed, its construction work has not been completed. The former head of Kabul Municipality said that before 2016, Due to the lack of internal capacity in the design department, municipal projects face serious problems. And even now, despite the efforts to create capacity in this department, the necessary facilities for the design of projects, there are no large projects inside the country, so the design and construction of large projects are given to foreign companies. The Wazirabad project is a big project that we could not accept any risk for its construction. But Khadib al Ilami Company was finally able to provide an acceptable design for this channel. However, the previous head of Kabul Municipality cites the lack of capacity and avoiding wasting time as the reason for handing over the design contract of Wazirabad Central Canal to the Lebanese company Khatib al Ilami without bidding. However, the head of the project to improve the efficiency of urban transportation in the former Kabul municipality, who is responsible for the implementation of this project, cites the opposition of the World Bank to assigning the tender for the design of Wazirabad project as the main reason for assigning this project to the Lebanese company. But a reliable source from the World Bank rejects these claims and says that the World Bank only paid for this project and has no role in announcing the tender, design, or construction of this project. The former mayor of Kabul said that the Wazirabad Canal was originally designed as an absorption channel because most of its water is rainwater, and it had to be built in an absorption form in order to strengthen the underground water. But the information shows that according to the latest design made by the municipality, this canal will be built in the form of a sewage canal that will take surface water out of the city along with sewage. This channel was designed in the form of an absorption channel in Kabul municipality, and two filter devices were also considered for water purification so that the underground water does not stop feeding. This channel was designed as a grid and contained a pump station to flow water. 
The design was considered in the form of an absorption channel and for 25 years of rain, which was not in accordance with the conditions of Afghanistan and was rejected. But the current design in 2016 is considered as a sewage transfer channel for 50 years of rain, and the work is going on accordingly. In 2016, in order to solve the problem of surface water in Kabul, this department conducted studies, as a result of which, in addition to the design of the central branch of the Wazirabad Canal, two new canals were also designed by this department, which are connected to the central canal. Since 2013, Kabul municipality has started the initial stages of work on the Wazirabad Canal. However, despite the financing of the World Bank, until now, 11 years have passed, this canal has not been constructed, while the Development Authority of the Capital Zone designed the three sub-canals of Wazirabad within three months and constructed them in less than two years. A sub-branch of the Wazirabad Canal, four kilometers long, starts from the traffic intersection and connects to the central canal from the old Taimani, Salim Karvan, and Shahid intersections. The second channel, two kilometers long, starts from the crossroads of Ariana Tank and connects to the central channel on the fifth road of Taimani. The third sub-branch is considered from the fifth road of Taimani to the central canal itself, and its procurement steps have also been completed, which has not been technically connected so far, and is waiting for the completion of the central canal work. The first channel was started in late 2016 and completed in early 2018, and the second channel was completed in late 2016 and finished in 2017. The design of these canals was done by the engineers of this department, and its construction was contracted to Mashrek Company after bidding. The first contract was worth 199 million Afghani, and the second canal was worth 105 million Afghani. However, due to the fact that the mentioned contracts were made based on the price per unit, the final price was lowered for the first project. 172 million Afghani, and for the second project, 86 million Afghani were paid through the Ministry of Finance. Coordinator of the project to improve the efficiency of urban transportation, the preliminary work on the Central Canal was started by the municipality in 2013, and so far its work has not been fully completed. Thank you for watching.